Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel, Events Decor by Lisa. Today, we're going to do a super special mini balloon garland. Now, we know that right now is graduation season, so I wanted to do a mini balloon garland that you guys are able to do at home for yourself, for your family members, or if you wanna do it for your small business, you can also offer it. Um, I like to do mini balloon garlands during seasons, for example, graduation or Mother's Day or seasons that I know, Father's Day, that are going to sell. So I can do one, post it and say, $60 for this mini balloon garland or $85 for this mini balloon garland, depending on what part of the country you live in. And you guys can offer it where people can just come, pick it up and go install it by themselves at home. Um, so of course you do wanna give them instructions, teach them how to install it and let them run with it. <laughs> All right, you guys, let's get started going to do this balloon garland black and gold and a few things of white. I'm going to use 18 inch black, 11 inch black, 5 inch black and I'm going to do that with um, gold and only about 5 inch of white. Okay. I also purchased two additional balloons from my local Dollar Tree store. So any 99 cent store, Dollar Tree store that you guys have around your house, around your area, um, just stop by and purchase some graduation balloons. I'll show you what they look like. These are the balloons that I purchased at my local um, Dollar Tree store. They just say, congrats, grad. And I'm going to add these two to my balloon garden. We're gonna get started with our 12 inch black balloons. So we're gonna do two of these. Remember we want them to be in a circle, twist and tie, okay? I'm gonna do my quad. to do two 12 inch but my next pair I'm gonna do a 12 and an 18 wait on that. I'm going to do all my sets and then I'm going to go from there. All right, so stay tuned. Let's do it together. black 260 balloon I am going to start tying them all up let's get started so I'm gonna start with the black I'm gonna get my 260 wrap it around and tie it I like to tie it twice make sure it's nice and tight my 
260 in. tie it to one of my necks. Remember that our lat, if you have a 260 pretty lengthy, just tie it to one of your necks. Now it's time to organize it. This is what it's looking like. I don't know if you guys can see it. This is your mini balloon garland to go. So before I add anything else, I'm going to go ahead and add our uh, congrats grad balloon. Congrats grad. And now we're going to add some of our five inch balloons into our mini garland. adding them to our balloon garland. Around. This is how it's looking. I'm going to bring you guys down so you can kind of see what it's looking like. Um, one of the things that I'm going to add in the back is two additional 260s so that way our customers, um, I'm going to tie it in the back and our customers can cut it and then tie it wherever they're gonna tie it. If it's gonna be to a backdrop stand, if it's going to be to the wall, I'll show you guys in another video how you can actually do that. But I give my customers instructions of how to do it. This is how our mini graduation balloon garland turned out. I hope you guys loved it as much as I do. I think this is great, especially for people who are in a budget and they just want something cute and simple for their loved one. This is an awesome option that you can offer them. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. You learned a thing or two. Don't forget to turn on that notification button, subscribe to our channel and like this video.